Hello everyone, I'm your host, Boss Zombie. Welcome back to the quarry. I've got to order a new webcam. This one's atrocious. It's so bad. It's... No matter what I do, it doesn't want to play nice. The only solution I found now is... The only remaining possible solution is I have to just plug it into USB 2.0... Yeah, slots on the computer. Because apparently... It's such a crummy webcam that it can't use 3.0 properly, and that might be why it's crashing so much. I don't recall that ever being a problem before, but who knows. But either way, I have to get a new one. It's 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 unreasonable at this point. No matter what I do, it doesn't work. Anyways, back to the quarry. Oh, and plus, having to fix that ruined my microphone for some reason. I had to restart the whole computer. I shouldn't have to be doing that. So, here we are. Stranded. In the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail, or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? <laughs> First course... Filet al Jacob. Rich and full body, this rare beefcake may <sighs> leave an irritating taste that has a on the palate. Much more potent effect taste. when he was wearing this outfit. Wow. What? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. No, he's got this. I don't need to kick. Look at that smile. Look at this big goober. Anything that doesn't make Emma feel more empowered, because I don't like her. Hi, there we go. And Viola. Uh, Your hair clip, madam. Yeah, you can keep it. It's not too shabby, huh? Yeah. I like a man who's good with his hands. Yeah, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> no, they don't. Okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? All right, the beard are. Beep, 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 beep. What Beep. are you doing? Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. Dude? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Again, they didn't because a lot of the... Chachki stuff Mr. is... Mr. H loved his accessories. None of that stuff seems to have left the shelf. I'm just gonna have to keep looking at the webcam. Hello, me. Don't you freeze, or I'll be very cross. <laughs> Think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. Oh, oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh, jackpot! Hey, uh, check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in a watermelon. Or, well, second most. Mm, gross still. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. Oh, right, my list of... I got so distracted. Troubleshooting. Why is she moving on her own? Controller, you better not start drifting. I just got you. Let's see, in the storage area behind the first shelf on the left. What does that possibly mean? The first shelf on the left. Oh, I guess this one. I don't think I got this last time. Did I? Harem scarum? Okay, the next one... 
end of the storage room, right side of the shelf, to the right of the big wooden table. Okay, so look out for... This is a weird way to organize a room, by the way, to have it so maze-like. Oh, right, and then doesn't Bobby come by the window at the one point here? Who buys this crap? There he is! Hey, Bobster! Alright, so I'm looking for a wooden table. I don't remember, was there anything down this way? Just unlocking the door, right? Which... Now that I think about it, really doesn't do anything. Like, there was this whole, like, almost, it felt like you were setting up for a confrontation and nothing happened. Same area as before, at the end of the storage room on the right side on a shelf. Where is that? I don't want to get too close to the back door. Oh! Here? Oh, wow. How would you notice this? Huh. Quote too high. Look for a cheaper option next year. Mm hmm. Okay, now we can go. Wait, I got all turned around. Where am I? Ah, here we go. Wonder where this goes. Locked. <laughs> Let him Jacob! do it. Come check this out. Oh. Uh, <laughs> All righty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Man, Jacob, you could do so much better than Emma. You're still a goofball, but you're not Done. terrible <laughs> to people. <laughs> <Whoa>. Mostly. <laughs> Whoa. Fucking mother love. Good Is golly, it? Miss it's just more garbage. I wonder if he kept this place locked up. I think he'll be pissed when we raid his stash. What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um... <clears throat> human rights, or... Whatever. Sure. Yeah. Alright. Now, let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh. Hell yeah. <clears throat> In and out. Job done. Boom! I wanna look around. Go for it. Okay, so I think I only need to get the backpacks and then the shotgun. Yep, yeah, those are our backpacks. Jacob, check this out. What? I can't. Oh, I really didn't know how notice lab. how scratched like up they are. Camping torn up. supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. Did a bear do this? Again with the bears. Is it really one per chapter with the bear thing? Shoddy. Oh, cool. What? What is it? A gun. Oh, cool. And a uh, code. Okay. I'm done. Man, they really are dumb. Oh. So you're, uh. Hey, she slung it over her keep the gun? left huh? shoulder. Now it's over yeah. her right? For bears. Okay. Uh, well, I am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp.
Why is he holding this door open? You don't need to hold this door open. I mean, I guess you're a gentleman. All right. Or not. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> Ooh, let me take the fireworks this time. What else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. W oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. Yeah, I'll take them this time. You know, you're right. Fireworks. <laughs> yeah, 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 hell yeah. Fireworks. Oh, um, and might I just add, um, fireworks. <laughs> hey, I found these, like, torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. <sighs> oh, dude! Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. We never did have a conclusion with those. What are butter pops? <sighs> no. What? I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um, <clears throat> pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my god. They're like the greatest snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing. Like their own subgenre of food snack. You know what? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait, is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old, aren't okay. they? Okay, look, they predate expiration dates. Blah. Well, you're gonna love them. Blah. Oh my god. All right. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in Again, there. the joke there is they're called uh, wheelbarrows, sorry, not barrels. Booty? Oh, it means like, um... Like treasure or buds? <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. She's making fun of him because that's not the word. <clears throat> Ladies first. Um, yep. Which way? You just left the melons on the counter. Okay, what do I need to look for next? Photo. With Dylan. No tarot cards. I'm surprised. I figured, I thought there for sure had to be one in there that I had missed. All right. The inner sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure, just give me a sec to get this going. And engage. Podcasts. Yeah. All right. I really do like Ryan's outfit. Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, Bizarre yet bona fide. So, like, ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like the the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and... Discussing if they're, well, bona fide. Boner fide. Get it? Boner. <laughs> Your wit knows no bounds. So, Smooth. should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. I mean, come on, what kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children going to have anyway? <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know. He's cool. Always been cool to me. I mean, I guess he is cool, but he does have some skeletons in his closet. Okay. Kaylee and Caleb Got Packett. that photo. Ugh. Weird kids, huh? I like them. Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Mm. 
Okay. What's... I think this is the next one. So they need to climb... Well, hello, hmm. what is this? Well, I didn't actually look down here last time, but this is just... You hear that? The bunker, isn't it? Is that a trap door? <laughs> I knew that there was a secret sex dungeon around here somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet you Mr. H is into some real kinky shit. Uh, I doubt it. Weren't there a couple of counselors who never showed up? Uh-huh. Why? Secret sex dungeon. Yeah, it's not funny. It probably just goes to the basement <laughs> or something. Open it up. I've been so wary right, of well, trap doors like in these games. Of eternal darkness, so... You're being dramatic. Climb down. Take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it. You climb down. Yeah. Let's see this time. Uh, why is a path chosen? Wait. What path was just chosen? Oh. What's down there? Oh my god, Ryan, you will what? not believe this. What, what, what? It's nothing. Oh, man. I had you go in there for a second, didn't I? No. Maybe. <laughs> Just shut up. It is uh, pretty spooky down here, though, and it smells very unnatural, so... Yeah, okay, I'm coming back up. Oh. What is that? I never even got to use the basement in my playthrough. What happened? Loosened a rung. Uh oh. Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. You better hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> Ring -a -ding -a -ding. Oh, sorry, bud. Gotta take this one second. Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that hmm. your impression of Mr. H? Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I. you're absolutely right. He does need to be nicer to Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Smooth. <laughs> So he should open a drawer here and get another clue, I think. Or is it evidence? I don't remember. Oh. Laura Kearney and Max Sprindley. Oh yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. Okay, so it's just the clue. Okay, so that's all it says for this section, so I guess we'll just explore. Well, the gun, right? Hey, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris, Mr. H told me it was for, um, bears. Bears? Here? <laughs> Again with yeah, the bears. Yeah, he said they don't really come around because he's got the gun to... Yeah. Just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. <laughs> Dude, we're gonna be out partying in the woods tonight, all right? What if the bears try to crash? Okay, it's it's like my mom always said. If you want to party, you gotta bring protection. <laughs> well, I think that she was talking about condoms. I'm not gonna fuck a bear. Oh, the Dylan. The most dangerous thing I've seen in these woods is a pissed off squirrel. That sounds pretty scary. Okay, fine. Well, we know where the gun is, if we need it. 
Your call, man. Okay. And in here. Wait. Yo, my guy. Toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? I I'm sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? Hardy har har. Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's... You're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but... <sighs> Nothing but that. <laughs> you're using that wrong. Huh. Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. Wow, there's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... Oh, oh, the secret door. Man, I love this filter. Uh, Brian? Whoa, what the fuck? These monitors, this is the camp. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, no, no, he can't be. These are just, they're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids, unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just, probably just, Trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People set them up to catch weird, random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? Like uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind of thing. So, okay, I'm going to upgrade Mr. H from super creepy pervert with a spy cam to, you know, super crazy conspiracy hunter. To be fair, Bigfoot's not a conspiracy. Okay, fine. How about an aspiring cryptozoologist? Hey, maybe he likes the podcast that you listen to. Sure, yeah. Let's go with that. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by stuff. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Ryan. It, it's weird. It's majorly yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but... It, it's It's got to be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's, it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure that won't be an awkward conversation, like, at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. All right. I, I'm leaving the secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. Yeah, doesn't Bobby come by now and... Why does he turn off one of the cameras now that I think about it? <clears throat> oh, I guess he doesn't? I thought he did. Okay, these are boring. I swear there was a... part where Bobby comes by and just turns one off. What was that? Oh, there we go. Oh, no, it's Jedediah. It's probably nothing. So is that one just off now? Yeah. Oh, I thought that was scripted no matter what. You have to sit here and actually wait for it to happen. Yeah. If you wait longer, does it happen again and he fixes it, puts it somewhere else? Why did the one on the left jump like that? Hmm. Okay. I guess that's all I'm going to get out of that. Oh, wait. What is this again? What are the X's? Sightings?
Reposition front. Oh, these are all the camera placements. Wow, there's a lot of them. What do these notes say? Check family back left camera. Reposition front right camera. Turn back something and something around wood walk. I can't read what that says. Clean all the lodge camera lenses. Place scrapyard camera front entrance. Okay. Hmm, but what about the rest of the room? I don't remember. Is there anything else in his actual room? There's the guitar. I think that's about it. All right. I'm surprised there isn't a trophy for like playing a bunch of instruments because between the guitar and the piano and well, there's some pretty heavy duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch that. Yeah, the syringes. Yeah, there's nothing fun. Uh, where's the exit? I always forget with this weird angle. Hmm. Wait, can I actually talk to Ryan? Is there anything important or interesting? So, got anything going on when you get back home? School or? Uh, jury's out. Understood. Girlfriend? Uh, not exactly. Boyfriend? Free agent. Cool, yeah. Me too. Are the, uh, phones? Uh, yeah, probably. You wanna check? Oh, let's just give him another minute or two, just to be sure. No, I think they're done. Nice. Not Full a lot of up. juice. Not even close. No, we're done. Hey, done so. Alright, cool, let's go. Us skedaddle. Thank you. Her hair is a beacon in this <laughs> with this filter. This should be a lot easier with Mr. H. Oh, let's go down the other actually I think I need to go down the other path. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. <laughs> they always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Man, they had a really interesting I'm dynamic, sure these two, and then he just disappears from the plot. Why don't you choose? Okay, so let's go Rocky Road. It is... Good choice. Better sticks this way. Better sticks? Uh, yeah. yeah. Like burning or whatever. This leads to a new area. Take the left path. Okay. Seems easy enough. Think we've got enough? Uh... Not yet. Alright, so left path. Um, I guess there is only one path and it's left. What is this? Quartzite? Non foliated metamorphic. So this rock, place was an was... actual quarry? Uh yeah. It was previously Apparently some of the caves run pretty deep. It's like a honeycomb under there. Cool. I wonder what it says. Pure quartzite is usually white to gray, but can be found in various shades of pink and red, yellow, green, blue, and orange. Okay. 
I didn't miss the path, right? I'm so... Unless... This way? No, that's just to go back. It just says, take the left path. Ah, I guess this is where it means to left half. Danger falling rocks. Oh. Alright, left path. It really is just a quarry, or an old quarry. There it is. The Hanged Man. Huh, are there, like, actual audio cues with the crows? To know when you're, like, near a tarot card? I wonder. Let's just keep going left, I guess. So, do we not have the boar interaction? So, you ever think about what's next? Like, after we die? It's heavy, man. No, I mean, like, the future. Yeah. Sometimes. All the time. It's so overwhelming. I know what you mean. Sometimes I just try to, like, let it happen, you know? What? Like, whatever happens is what was meant to happen. Like it's all predetermined. Fate. He is so tall and she is so short. Well, these both suck. I don't know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah. Fate just seems so... Convenient. Wait, does he have enough buttons on his collar? How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? I never really thought about it like that before. I mean, well, it's, it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah. Hmm. That's interesting. We didn't have that conversation on the other path. I for even for I forget what they even talked about in the other path. Can I go? Oh, I can go this way. Where the? Where are we going? Are we just roaming aimlessly? Did we somehow loop around to the same... Oh, I know where we are. Yeah? How did we end up in the same... Up here. What? Here, hold these. Sure. Is this the same place? No, this must be a different... No, maybe it's not. It might be the same place and we somehow looped around the same way. Or there's two identical set pieces. Ah yes, the notebook that somehow fits in the smaller bag. Is just... wow. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no. This is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. Okay, so we're I still going to have the boar encounter, what and I can finally of, do know? the actual breathing I'm thing. I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course. I just... don't know what... You'll figure it out. Oh. Transition. I don't know, they just kind of seem like a weird pairing. It's nice, but... It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. 
little, little piggy. It is very cute. Look! Oh, it's so tiny. My god, he's so cute. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Mama Pig. Oh, right. I didn't get to see this. You're in danger. Oh, there's no music Hunted here. by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting then which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger is past, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. <laughs> I love those little animatics. Alright, so you have to hold X and then let go. I think when the red disappears, you're safe. The red flashing. So like now. <laughs> Why does he hide behind her? Jeez. Oh, that was close. He almost just mowed me to death. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, little piggy hog. <laughs> Well, he can be really pedantic. At least we gave her a good story to tell her pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? Mm, I got a pretty good look. Ew! I think she was coming on to me. Oh, got yourself a little girlfriend. Well, she wasn't that little. <laughs> I don't know why they're joking, because boars are genuinely scary. And dangerous. Uh, impossible. That goes right in there and fits somehow magically. That backpack should be at least twice its size. Guess we should head back. That's not the end of the chapter, is it? Uh, actually, it might be the end of the chapter. Uh, it's not. Do I need to do anything else? No. Oh, right. She saw something I didn't see it the first time. Let me look again. She said she saw a light on in the... I finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. Oh, it's much more noticeable now with the filter. Oh, I can take a photo? Was I able to do that before? I don't remember taking a photo. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Uh, I did see you really don't play as Caitlyn, like, at all in this yeah, game. Was pretty spooky. You control her here. Maybe your girlfriend, Brian. Hag of a little bit Corey. in one chapter with a gun, and then in the cabin. I told you never cabin. say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Are you done? 
You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick, just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. <laughs> it's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. <laughs> big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. Oh, I just want to shrink you Again, down to another the weird line. Put it in my pocket and keep from it to Caitlin, I don't understand. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's the reaction. Like she says weird things and people react. Up. Oh. Whoa. That's loud. Special delivery. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun come right, from? Dude, relax. Okay, it's not even real. Uh, God. Well, I mean, it's every real time gun, I forget what Jacob is wearing. Found it in the storage room. Okay, fine, fine. We'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and, we bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on, Emma. Please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. No, I still agree with this. There is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old fashioned shootout. First prize. Peanut butter butter pops all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! Man, Jacob, gun safety. Give me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on! Yeah, why was she saying that but loading the gun? All right. Yeah. Guess we're going to have ourselves so, an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clear Mixed messages. A shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh, we'll be good. <laughs> and meanwhile, Abby is just there. I completely forgot about the shooting part. Okay, so, just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you actually... Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. So, Where are the watermelons? How's your little... There's a lot of... One with Abby the just, world? like, things are convenient. It was... it was okay. Hey! Atta boy! So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. Yeah? Mmm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 hey, look, no sweat, okay? 
We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Speaking of, so, you know what? Maybe I don't like Jacob. Shoots his gun. I think I only like Jacob because he was being put down by ammo, but I don't think I like either of them, really. Just give me the gun. Uh uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obs. All right, so I guess the watermelon... Oh, I forgot right, that it has Nick, resistance. One point. Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay, good. All right, so I guess I'll shoot the watermelon and then the bottles. All right, Nick. This time for real. So watermelon. Nice shot. And then, can I hit both of these with one? Ah, I can. Lucky. Then I'll shoot this boy over here. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right. You might want to, uh, Avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. Oh, I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this freaking cannon dude, blaster. That is how you get someone shot. God. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. Oh, I get, Sorry, Jake. I didn't even know the other one is the butter pops thing. <laughs> butter like next time? Hey, I didn't want to say it, but <laughs> you're both very mean. And then Caitlin destroys us both. One. Blam! We thought this was over. What the? Whoa! Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Technically, I think I still got four points, or maybe five. I'm not sure. Oh, this, this, uh, these chapters are so long, I had completely forgotten. Right, because this, this, I forgot this scene has to happen, too. There's no music at all. This is so weird with no... That's <laughs> so weird. Okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Come on, people. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? Mm. Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So like normal truth or dare? Yes. So we can like make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Of course. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants. That's until my it's phrase. Turn, but... <laughs> I use cool beans. Well, it's house deals, so. Maybe I should stop using cool beans if it's, if they write it in this game. Truth or dare? Ooh, her hair looks almost um... pink. Truth. You really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I, uh, I... Hey, 
Take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on. I, I'm not finished. Um, have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? You have to get over, Dylan. No. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um. Oh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. Okay, okay, um. What was Nick doing in the background? I just noticed. I don't know. Ugh, ding, 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 too late. My turn. Ryan, truth or dare? Uh. Oh wait, I want to do the dare. Dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare comes with a choice. Can't you do that? I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you to kiss either Caitlin or Dylan. Wow. I mean, I guess both is off the table. Sorry. I don't make the rules. I mean, you literally <laughs> just did, but okay. Let's do this. I mean, Dylan. Dylan and Ryan are literally the best characters in this Dylan. game. Let's go. Laura, too. <laughs> Always happy to please. Woo! All righty. Who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Hmm. I asked... Let's do Jacob this time, because I asked Caitlin All last right, time. All right, Jacob, let's see what you're made of. Oh, there. There, man, come on. Okay. I dare you to take a flying leap over that fire pit. <laughs> Naked. Oh, dude! Fuck yes! Oh, I will jump over this thing, I don't care. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. Uh-oh, this might have been a mistake. No, no, Jacob, wait. Don't do it. Stop. Dude, I say veto. You're going to fuck yourself up. What? No, come on, man. It, it looks almost on. no different. Fine, veto. You know what? Fuck this game. All right? <clears throat> Someone else can go. Okay, fine. Then I call your turn. <clears throat> Whatever. Oh, so that was completely point. It looks no different. Emma, there. Ah, so there was no point Emma, to that. Emma, so you have to kiss... Jacob? Or... Oh. Nick. Uh. <laughs> well then. Um, uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. Nick, you're an idiot. I don't feel bad that you leave um, the story so quickly. Seriously? Also, the fire lose quality from the last time I played through here, I feel like it's not as good looking as before. Guys. Oh, I just you, noticed he took off his his jacket here. So the outfits are slightly modular, I guess. He's good. She's an idiot. They're both idiots. You're like kissing my girlfriend. And he's an idiot too. What happened to his It was just a game. Yeah, his crop top got girlfriend. even more cropped the up. What happened? It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. It wasn't that Jacob, high cut before. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. You should probably go find Abby. You're both dumb. You're both super dumb. You're both... I guess you need to have idiots so, like this to get the story going. What? Wow, this chapter's almost an hour long.
<laughs> I love this part. Uh, fuck this. Bye, I loved you in Detroit Become Human. Wait, that was him, right? I'm getting my actors mixed up. Welcome back. I am, as always, delighted. Oh, I didn't that find this card here. last time, but I also don't want to know about so, it. So then, what more has been found? Ooh, that's a pretty gruesome-looking. The hanged man. <laughs> to be the hanged man is to surrender, and by doing so gain a new perspective so look carefully and consider that sometimes one needs to be strung up in order to let go but these are just words there's more to show you if you'll let me no there's no shit okay and now we're gonna do this And right back in. There's no shame in not wanting to glimpse into the futures that may come to be. All I'm trying to do is help. But the last thing I want to do is take your choices. I wonder if she goes, becomes progressively like more... From me. Oh. That's all I have to say for now. So you do get more interesting dialogue if you pass on the cards. The night grows darker. Plus, it's not like I'll the cards really again. help. They show you a scene that you have no idea how to influence. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Mm -hmm. And my webcam survived a whole recording again. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I mean, I know what I'm going to do with it. I'm going to get a replacement. Re I'm going to replace it. All right, so what's... Is all the same. That's new uh, evidence. Torn bags. That's nothing new there. Oh, this has a connection now. I didn't get this connection last time. Whatever these poses are doing in Chris Hackett's possession, he must have forgotten to take this one down. Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. These are the same as the poster in the woods. Why does Chris Hackett have them? Was he connected to Harem Scarum in some way? Okay, we got the family photo and I guess a connection I don't have yet. Okay, and what's changed pathwise? I guess that's it. Alright, well, we'll continue in the next episode then. Oh, this might be the first chance to get someone infected. Maybe, I don't know. Find out in the next episode. So thanks for joining me. Come back, I'll have the next stuff up real soon, but until then, bye.